hello everyone welcome in my channel asp.net core today i'm going to show you the next video tutorial of uh, many to many relationship in asp.net core this is the edit section in which you can pass the string of id and get a um, single uh, tag uh, using model and just convert it into the view model that is tag view model in the edit section after uh, you can make you uh, you can change uh, anything using the edit section and post uh, that uh, data in the post section to the post section okay so uh, that is the edit section is the similar with the create section so just uh, only single method dot tag dot update at here so that is now after that you can uh, you can uh, work on your uh, delete section delete action method actually uh, just i want to retrieve first uh, um, tag by their id property and just i want to confirm are you sure you want to delete that data that type of message and after that i want to delete uh, a tag okay so in the delete post section tag view model vm and just again copy that uh, create or uh, uh, update section and just only change that is this method dot delete method okay so you can use it that types of feature create a uh, hair loss that is add it if make some any changes in the id property that also will changes so remove the id property from the edit section okay that's fine again you can run your project to check id is not existed here if make some changes occurs yeah that is no problem okay guys uh, just move to the post section also so here loss is removed by the delete action method now add a new controller that is the post controller okay so read write also use posts controller in the post controller also add uh, two dependency injections uh, interfaces at here that is like unit of work and the imapper class okay uh, that is and also initialize in the constructor and in the index method first of all uh, get all the post by using um, unit of work so add a new view model class that is post view model in which you can add both pro uh, all these properties uh, which is included in the post model that is id title and description okay now after that you can use get all method uh, of uh, post unit of work so unit of work dot post dot get all and then convert that model into the view model by using the mapper so mapper dot map list of post view model and uh, just model and pass that view model to in the return section of the view also add a mapping profile in the helper class that is create map just i want to change model to the view model so post comma post view model okay save this and pass it here view model right click on the index section method and add a new view and add as a model that is post view model and a scaffolding that is type of list now after that you can add a create uh, action method in create action method uh, must to add a new class that is post create view model in the post create view model add uh, that is there is no need to uh, add a id property of the post only title description 
and also add a list of tags so tag view model you can add it here instead of tag view model you can use select list items so after that make some changes in the uh, tag view model tag cre uh, create tag uh, post create a view model so first of all get all the tags from the repo repository by using the unit of work and after that use for each loop that tags from repo and one by one item is actually inserted into the select list so select list equals to new list of select list items and that is available in the rendering dot asp dot car dot mvc dot rendering and add select list dot add new select list item in select list item you can add the first thing is the title that is text and the second thing is the value so item dot id so item dot title and item dot id that is thing so now after that you can view model new post create view model and in which you can add tags initialize that tags with the select list items so select list it here because uh, select list is not uh, a post create view model uh, matched with your post create view model so just change your post create view model that is select list items that's fine now after that you can uh, generate your view section by using the view model add as a template that is create and in the model class you can choose post create view model by by using the scaffolding you have only the title and the description make some uh, things in the view section like select list with the multiple select okay so asp net 4 and uh, asp items that is tags model dot tags in asp4 you can select uh, also add another property in the view model that is string of array selected tags and in asp4 you can use selected tags option values okay you can check your uh, data will post in the post section by the form so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net core many to many relationship uh, if this video is helping for you so please like this video and share this video on your social profiles. Okay, so uh, select tag that is weight loss. Yeah, the old things are there in as it in the selected tags, but it's not multiple. So make some changes in the select list as a multiple. Thank you very much for watching.